see anything. You can't see anything. Well, you don't have to worry. I'm gonna be your guiding light. Now, let's go through this bullshit all over again. It's empty. Okay, we're off to a flying start. The only thing I'm actually concerned about now is the witch. Apparently I found the first paper. Uh, I found some paper at the pump room. It's been two days since the crow has attacked me. Yeah, I read this. I read this. It's empty. Uh, all I need now is a flare. And another one. So one after another. Okay. The crows weren't hurting me. I understand now. We all serve. We all offer up flesh for the return. I must find flesh for the birds. <laughs> flesh for the return. The crow man. The fuck. Now, I think that was the letter that I was missing. And I looked everywhere. I swear. And now this bullshit is gonna kill me because I don't have any fucking flares. Yeah, right. They weather in flames, Sarah. Use it to your advantage. They will not harm you if you do. Hey there, lovely. Just hanging. Chilling. Fuck you. I still got scared by that shit. Well, that's my talent, what can I say? So where is the shadow lady? I know your tricks. Uh, February 5th, 1920, concerning death of Officer Dawson. I read this. Low stick. Uh, 23rd, 1940, Rob Sandoval, second floor lighting. I read this. Okay. I saw you. Found the glow stick. Lucky me. And I also found the gate right there. September 14, 1930. Adam Perry Peterson. Service pipe leak sewer. With the funds available, I managed to hire two temporary workers to come down and tackle the pipe problem. Other problems were deemed irrelevant. However, retaining those employees is proving to be a problem. I don't speak much of their language, but they keep saying something about a flashing light and a face. I have no idea what they're talking about. I'll admit, though, uh, those stories of wandering shadows do feel a bit more real down here. Well, it's, uh, it's because they're real, so yeah. I mean, I would feel uneasy in a sewer. So much bullshit. I actually heard her pass me. <laughs> oh. 
She's doing that shit that? just so that she can. Ah, oh, you bitch. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me though. The flare saved me. Glow stick. Okay, I've been through here. Okay, I'm down on the sixth page again. I need to find the sixth page. Hopefully, it's not gonna screw me like the last time. Oh God, what's that? Uh, pipes. Okay, cool. What well, was? I mean, last time. Why? Why couldn't this happen last time? So, came at us with the pipe, and yeah, it's basically the Dawson fellow dying and shit. You're not gonna catch me, you're not gonna catch me. You're not gonna catch Oh my god, she scared the shit out of me. Please tell me it isn't true. It can't be. They never forgave those who persecuted them so. 400 years of rage, Sarah. 400 years of rage. I still, I still don't understand what this Sarah fellow, this Sarah, Sarah, this Sarah girl, girl, what the? This Sarah girl has to do with all this, to be honest. Oh man. I am screwed. I'm basically running in circles now because that bitch was chasing me. Four hundred years of rage. Ah, oh, come on. That should have been like the fastest level. Sometimes we built too many walls and not enough bridges. But these walls allowed for more delicate work. Work without interruption, focused and precise. Awful. That freaking thing just took the joy. <laughs> uh the joy uh the joy from me little thing over there that freaking pick up from last time the more I keep up this diary bit this diary business the more I feel like I took to uh, wandering to the tunnels a bit and found the old pump room I he I heard they want to treat the sewage on the island here to treat the sewage on the island here turn it into drinking water or something Guess it never really got that far off to uh, that uh, that far off the ground. So it's my good fortune. Now I got this nice little private office with a desk I can use uh, when Mercer 
when Mercer isn't using it. It's almost like my own personal little fortress. Okay. Interesting. I really need to, uh... Okay, there goes that, uh, glow stick. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, two letter combo. Mercer told me I couldn't come to my office anymore. Actually, her office. Uh, he, so he said. Uh, so he, he's a he. I thought uh, that I was Sarah Mercer. So that uh, pretty much uh, destroys my my whole idea plot. Uh, he says there's too much work to do for me to come down here whenever I want. I try to explain to him that I need this place. That I, it helps me deal with the stress. Uh, what does he care though? Uh, what does he care though? I can't write anything anymore. I can't write anywhere else. Uh, this is the only place I feel like I hear the real things inside my head. It's odd. I n I'm never lonely down here. It feels like I'm with my mother, but she died years ago. There's some sort of presence here, and I can't give that up. I think this is where I belong. Your mother? So your mother is the bitch who's been chasing me, so... So is that your mother? Given time, one can conceive the unconceivable. Whatever that means. One of the new guards went missing. We don't typically, co typically go come down here, but Mercer asked us to find him before he gets in the way of the work we're doing. I hope he... I hope the kid's okay. Okay. What was that sound? Sounds like the boiler. Or whatever that thing is. He feels like he's with his mother. And also, he didn't give a name or anything. Glow sticks! Yay! We found him. We all knew he was upset about this, about how some of the other uh, guards were treating him. But uh, the doc, the docs told us his uh, diary was helping him. I read through it. I read through it to uh, look for a suicide note, but his last entry doesn't make any sense. I trust transcribed uh, transcribed here for clarity, and we're going to pass it on to the police in case it's some kind of code. Thirteen, 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 thirteen. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, and it still keeps going. Okay. So am I supposed to uh, transcribe that note? I'm not gonna do that. Doc, I did what you asked. Patient of 13's records were destroyed and we burnt everything that she ever wore, uh, used or created in the sewer furnace. How did you know about the old furnace down in the tunnels? 
doesn't look like anyone's been there in decades. 13, patient 13. I read about her. I can't really remember. Trying actually. Midla uh, Midla Mid Island Hospital Maintenance Report, October 13, 1932. Adam Peterson service reset power to bridge. We almost lost the bridge the other day after a heavy rain. Remember, when we uh, get additional fluids running through here, we must raise the bridge. It's your only way out of here. If the power cuts out again, it uh, must be reset in order to uh, in order for the bridge to operate. All pump room staff needs to familiarize to be familiarized with the with this proce process. We wouldn't want anyone getting stuck down here and missing their ferry off the island. Okay, so I already did that. Basically, Sarah is trying to get off the island right now. I'm just gonna do this one more time. Looks awesome. I'm gonna do this with what now? <laughs> no, it's my only flare. Put that back. No, I need that. How they connect? I, I know I read something about patient 13. Beginning, but uh, quiet, so quiet. All I ever wanted, all I ever needed. So, is this the guy? I got it too. No, I got it all right. Now you're here, and you and me. So, is this the guy who wrote the note that he feels like he's almost with his mother here? Something like that. Nothing here, obviously. What the fuck? Yeah, of course that happened. There's a way up there. Can I go through here? No, I can't. That's my only way. Well, that pretty much narrows it down. And we are out. That's the city, right? Cool. Just how fit are you, sir? Going to try to swim for it. Huh. I'm not gonna make it. I bet you I'm not gonna make it. So I am outside right now, huh? Okay. Is this gonna work outside? Apparently it works, but. I uh, really do think it has limitations or something. So, it's pretty obvious that there's no fucking ferry. I don't know what I just did, but I <laughs> apparently I did something. Gasoline. Huh. 
Why did I do that exactly? Oh, so that I can go through here. Oh, I get it. Silly me. I didn't even know that that was <laughs> what I what I was supposed to do. Uh, let's see here. No, you're not gonna letting me. You're not gonna let me throw there. Not gonna letting me. What the fuck? <laughs> Boxes with ropes can be moved, apparently. And there's a letter there. Uh, is that a GNC investments, I think? Uh, dates May 19th, 1986, uh, concerning Jason Bertelli. Employee believed to have survived the fall, but died afterwards from injuries. Unexpected. Planes. Sorry about that. Loss of eyes. Um, unexplained loss of eyes, though. Some believe this could uh, have happened in the fall. Doctors wanted to perform autopsy, uh, autopsy, uh, but we're uh, ruling this one uh, an accident and moving on. Family of deceased has been notified. Yeah, you, you find you you're gonna find somebody with. Uh, their eyes gouged out, and you're gonna declare it as a freaking accident. It is what it is, I guess. Anything else here? Anything else? Surprise or something? No, I can't go there. Okay, cool. May 26, 1986, concerning uh, unexplained occurrence on job site. Numerous complaints that workers have been seeing things. When asked to elaborate, some have said they see people out of the corner of their eye, uh, only to turn and nothing is there. A general sense of dread and of being watched seems to be affecting all workers. The highest volume of complaints comes from the night shift, which has gone so far as to state uh, seeing actual people with the within the construction area. Well, uh, that's not comforting at all. Was there another letter here? Yeah, there was. Charter boat catches fire. June 16, 1939. Tragedy once again strikes New Kipling. This time, as a charter bo boat Compass Lily caught fire while rounding the coast of uh, Mid Island. It is believed that 1,342 people were on board at the time and only 332 have since been confirmed alive. The survivors were rushed to the Mid Island hospital and given immediate, immediate care. Man, 1,000 people? Man. Charter boat catches fire June 16, 1939. According to official investigation, it is believed that the, the accident was caused by a problem in the engine room. It has also uh, been discovered that all safety protocols were incredible, incredibly substandard, and rumors uh, abound that the boat's chief engineer was mentally unstable. The company that owned the compass will be. Um, has stated that they are deeply sorry. <laughs> yeah, you kill 1,000 people, and you're gonna say that you're deeply sorry for what for what happened, and has promised that we'll uh, use state of the uh, art safety procedures from now on. Mm -hmm. It's been a long week, and it's not getting any shorter. Everyone's been working extra long hours since the ferry crashed. Nobody knows what to say to each other anymore. 
my sister died on that boat, but you don't see me slowing down because of it. Oh, that seems kind of weird. Uh, these patients need us, even the ones who can't muster more than a, a blank stare into space. Even the ones who can't stop reliving the nightmare of watching their friends and loved ones drown because of a madman. We all do what we can, because we must. Nurse Elizabeth Daniels. Well, I guess she's right. I mean, what can you do in that type of situation? Incident report. Date, March 7th, 1933. Uh, the reports keep pouring in from anonymous locals concerning bodies washing up on the shore. Usually these reports are uh, accompanied by witnesses stating that the deceased are wearing prison uniforms consistent with those from the prison on Mid Island. Each time we drive to the scene, though, the bodies are mysteriously gone. The only thing we ever see are a bunch of crows. For now, we're putting these calls on low priority standing. It's probably just some kids pulling pranks. And I read a letter earlier stating that we need to feed them flesh. <laughs> Is that the ferry? Or the hospital burning. Either way, it's burning. There's no escaping fate. I guess. Okay, then. forest but I wonder what was I could have gone to the other side as well ah shit can I go still I don't know can I I mean where did I come from where is the actual entrance I can't see a damn thing So, I'm basically blocked here, okay, okay, oh, no, no, okay, 